As an unmarried mother of three living in the city of Atlanta, let's go over exactly how much it costs to live. Number one, you have rent. That's approximately $2,800 a month. Then you have your utilities, which includes gas, light, water, and internet. All that totals to about $600 a month. Hi, I'm the original creator of that video. And I think a lot of you guys are missing the point. And the main reason that you're missing the point is because you hate single moms. And not just single moms, single black moms. Single black moms who are not struggling. And there are a lot of us. I am not anything special. There are a lot of single moms out here who are unmarried and doing their thing, taking care of their kids and living a great life. Which was the actual point of this video. When Tyler Perry said that we as women should settle for men who can only pay the light bill, there was a ton of backlash and rightfully so. Because if there are women out here with children who are doing the damn thing, who are keeping up with their bills, who have great credit, who are, are making investments, who are traveling around the world with their kids, who are providing the best life possible for them and also one, two, three, multiple children. Why, as a man at your big age, can you not afford to pay anything but the light bill? So the point of the video was not to find a man that could pay my expenses, because guess what? I'm paying my expenses. The point of the video is why is the bar so low, especially in our community when it comes to our men, that we would have to accept somebody that is grown in their 30s, 40s, sometimes 50s and 60s, and they can't afford anything but the light bill. That's homeless, sir. And contrary to popular belief, single moms are not shelters for homeless men. Single black moms are not shelters for homeless men. And that's why there are so many men and male-centered women who are just triggered in the comments of that video. Because in order for them to survive, they have to make women like me feel some type of way so that we lower our standard to accept the bar that is on the ground for grown adults. If a woman with children who has to work with their schedule, has to find childcare, has to maintain a home on their own, has less hours to work than a grown single man. If that woman with multiple children can take care of herself and not only take care of herself, but live a life that is soft and luxurious. What is wrong with him that he can't at least provide that type of lifestyle for himself.